Hello everyone, Sunshine Rogers here, and I am so excited because I have written 12 different books, and I am primarily a Christian author. So most of my books are set in heaven. They're set on earth. They have um, spiritual beings as main characters, meaning that God and angels and Jesus, and yes, the Holy Spirit, they're main characters in my stories. And I love incorporating them as as beings, as real people, as, as real entities that help us in our everyday lives. And also so often in my stories, there's boardroom meetings because I love thinking about what is heaven up to? What are they discussing? What's on their minds? And I love thinking about even though we're so unaware that God is still in control and he's still helping us and he's still making plans for our good. So I love incorporating all of that into my stories. So in my Christian children's book, last night when I prayed, the main character, Dimitri, he goes up to the throne room to talk to God directly. In my Christian fiction novel, The Characters Within, God has a hands-on meeting with his angels to discuss earth, which I love. And in my Christian fiction novel, This Is My Heaven, it is told from the viewpoint of a man who works in heaven, and God is his boss. And so he's in boardroom meetings with the angels and the Holy Trinity and, um, and what they say and what they do to make earth a better place. But for today, I want to talk about my more recent published novel, The Rolling Sisters in the Spirit Program. And there's also a boardroom meeting Seen in this book as well. So you can tell I have this ongoing theme of what God is saying and what he's up to and what he's thinking up in heaven. So I was hoping that we could get a taste for what I write here in this book. Let me turn to the pages here. <clears throat> okay. Charlie stands next to a projector screen displaying colorful charts and graphs. He opens the meeting by declaring that 15,533 humans have entered through the pearly gates in the last 24 hours. Compared to last year, this quota is down by 13% as more humans are now choosing allegiance to the other kingdom. Charlie explains, we are losing souls to the other kingdom week by week. It's devastating. Humans have turned their attention towards the wrong things, and we are losing them one by one. Mike, La Mike Laflame, the case manager sitting to my right, asks me where I am with case number 296. Still making headway, I explained to the room. These two sisters have been in the program for years and still have not reconciled their differences. You know, another case manager interrupts, we are not looking for reconciliation. So what are we looking for, team? Charlie hypes. Forgiveness of the past, freedom in the present, joy for the future, the room chants. And what is our motto? The angel Gabriel shouts. We never give up on our patients. The room echoes again. Hopefully you'll enjoy my scenes in this book. Rolling Sisters in the Spirit program is available on paperback, hardcover, ebook, and audiobook. And I know that you'll be blessed by this story. Well, I hope you have an amazing day and thank you so much again.